There are a number of features you want to take advantage of while using Atmosphere. These include transferring data between instances and the iPlant data store, attaching an EBS volume, and creating an image. If iDrop is installed on your Atmosphere image, click on the iDrop icon. Enter your iPlant username and password, and click Login. To upload an atmosphere using iDrop, locate a file in local directory, the left column. Drag the file or folders into a location in your iPlant data store directory, the right column. When asked to confirm, select yes to begin the transfer. To download files into your Atmosphere instance from the iPlant Data Store, locate the iPlant Data Store directory in the right column. Drag the files or folders to location in your local files directory, the left column. When asked to confirm, select Yes to begin the transfer. To use I commands in your Atmosphere instance, open a terminal or SSH into your instance. In order to complete the setup, you'll need to enter the following. For enter the host name of the server to connect to, use data.iplancollaborative.org. For enter the port number, use 1247. For enter your iRod's username, enter your iPlant username. For enter your iRod's zone, use the word iPlant. For enter your current iRod's password, use your iPlant password. You can test that I commands is properly configured using the ILS command. This will allow you to view the contents of your data store. At the shell prompt, enter the command ILS. To download files using I commands, start I commands if you have not already done so using the I initiate command. Then use the I git command to download the files or folders. To upload files from your instance back into the iPlant data store, if you have not already done so, start iCommands using the iInit command. 
Use the iPut command to upload the files or folders into the iPlan Data Store. Connecting an EBS volume allows you to attach additional storage space to your Atmosphere instance. In order to create a volume, click My Volumes in the left column. Name the volume, select a size, and click Create Volume. Once the volume is ready, drag the volume to the desired instance. Connect to the instance and use the following commands to create the file system. Mount the file system using the following commands. Save any data. Enter the following command at the terminal. Click My Volumes in the Atmosphere Airport, and then click the X icon to detach the volume. Select the Instance to Image and click Image. Read the wiki link and ensure your instance complies with iPlan's policies for imaging. Complete the imaging form and click Request Imaging. You will be notified when the image is complete. Need more help? Visit the iPlant user form at ask.iplantcollaborative.org.